Hi, it's Julie Wolf, Skype expert, coach, trainer, and I'm going to make a video of how you can see the Skype chat room guidelines with the Skype command git slash git guidelines. It's a command, so it has to be exact. So there has to be a, a slash like that, and then you type git, and there has to be one space can't be any space before the slash and then you type the rest of the word guidelines or you can usually copy them from copy the exact spelling from the title of the room here or you can copy it from someone else giving it to you make sure that there is no extra spaces and everything is exact because it is a machine command. It is a Skype command. So it's slash get guidelines. Boom. And there they show up. Guidelines. Guidelines equals. It's a sys message so when you enter that it is the you are the only one to see it. No one else will see it. Sometimes they're long, sometimes they're short, they often have links, and they usually have both rules and resources. Like here we have rule number one is please agree with my general Skype room guidelines. <laughs> and then uh, Skype me is what it says there on my blog. Um, in the room you can give a handshake once you have read them. So let me be clear on this. I have external general Skype room guidelines okay which you can find on my blog and read and then Skype me and tell me that you have read and agreed them my Skype ID is Julie Wolf or Julie Wolf 2 currently I'm mostly on Julie Wolf 2 so you might want to try that one first <laughs> but add both here's where my general Skype room guidelines are they're at income assurance blog just find the Skype menu and go down to Skype Rooms. It will be there, but you can also click Skype Room Guidelines right here. And uh, so you have to add, if we're not contacts, you have to add me first and you have to tell me that you've read and agreed with my general Skype Room Guidelines and then you need to uh, tell me what room you want to join. If you just want to join general Skype rooms in general, I'm not very impressed by that. <laughs> you need to, my rooms are topic focused. In this room I'm teaching message magic. Okay, I have many Skype rooms. But inside of the Skype room you're going to find the internal guidelines. Okay, which contain both r rules and resources. Okay, and usually in most of my Skype rooms, the command is in the in the title of the room, the name of the room, so you can do it. But it has to be exact. There can't be any spaces there. Okay, there was a space there. Did you see that? I got rid of it. Okay, or just type it slash get g u i d lines. It, they usually contain things related to the room that you want to know like resources. Here's how to do the 10 day challenge step by step guide to massive action and massive results I should say. <laughs> Number three, here's the getting started guide. Okay, that's where you invite people to get started with message magic. It helps them with a few steps they need to take and it lets them know about my membership see you on Skype. But anyways, there's resources in here. If you need help it talks about when the trainings are. You can talk about when your trainings are. Then your moderators can go in and get these and remind your members when trainings are. You know, And if people really have trouble getting these uh, internal guidelines with the Skype command get guidelines, you can always have your moderators copy and paste them into the room. You can put links to the moderators so that they can get one-on-one -on -one help if necessary. But the most important thing is when we say type slash get guidelines into the chat box or key it in, it means this. Type it out exactly or copy and paste it exactly. No spaces on either side. I'm going to hit the home key and hit the backspace key. There is no space there. Good. So it's slash get space guidelines with an S. It has to be exact. When you hit enter, 
the guidelines show up only for you. Okay, so you can look at them and access them at any time. There are room rules and resources. Okay, that's it. Thank you for watching. Julie out.